In the past uh, 20 years or so, unfortunately, we've had a lot of wounded warriors who come back uh, from other parts of the world with amputations. So the Department of Defense has put a lot of research into better prosthetics uh, and new techniques. Here at Ohio State, uh, we've had a couple plastic surgeons who served our wounded warriors at Walter Reed learn techniques from the the soldiers that they helped them heal and repair their wounds and brought techniques such as targeted muscle re which allows their nerves to heal better uh, and uh, not have phantom pain, uh, or at least markedly decreased, uh, and then combining that with osseo integration that they also used in the soldiers, and we're bringing those techniques that helped the soldiers uh, after they recovered from their war injuries to cancer patients because cancer has, unfortunately, when we have to do an amputation to remove and cure the patient's cancer, we want to make the patient as functional as possible. So we're using those techniques that the uh, surgeons used for the wounded warriors now to make cancer patients more functional.